agent red multiple felonies 15 facebook accounts hacked stole 500 v bucks from andrew tate's fortnite account agent blue looks rather innocent but he cracks absolutely horrible jokes he once said why did the ai stay up all night because it wanted to be a algorithm <laughs> yeah let's move on in this video our agents are gonna go head to head in a 1v1 battle my lovely fellas, you see, our agents are very simple 3D models inside Unity. These models are given a brain using deep reinforcement learning. The algorithm used is proximal policy optimization, which is basically an algo inside deep reinforcement learning, which we will be using in this video. Essentially, our agent is given a reward and a punishment for certain actions. In our case, when the agent itself falls on the ground, it earns a minus one reward. However, when the opponent falls on the ground, our agent earns a plus one reward. Regarding the observations, which is essentially how the agent sees the world, our agent can observe the position, velocity, and rotation of itself and its arms. It can also do the same of the opponents. I've got you in my sights. Action wise, our agent can move forward, backward, right, and left. It can also rotate its arms with a certain degree of limitation and now it's time for the most epic AI battle you have ever seen ladies and gentlemen what you just saw was basically four invisible walls. The agent hit an invisible wall and it reset to its original position. This is to make sure that the agent learns from his actions. Now specifically, those invisible walls have a negative 0.5 reward. So hopefully over time, the agent learns not to touch the walls. Now you can clearly see that the movement of the agent is not quite smooth right now because it is basically learning, exploring the environment, seeing what actions lead to the most rewards. There are 47 more environments behind the scene. So there are basically other agents which using the same brain training. What this does is it speeds up the training by a lot because more environments means that the agent ends up doing a more diverse range of actions and exploring more but since the brain is only one they learn faster so they gain experience faster this is a really great way to speed up training in this video's timestamp of 4 minute 35 seconds the agent will be shown after 4 hours of training Guys, it's been 4 hours and now you can already see that the agents are really beefing with each other. Because now they have realized that hitting the walls is of really no use because they get smacked with a negative 0.5 punishment. And I am pretty sure that by now in some parallel universe, one of the agents toppled the other one over and was like, wait, the opponent just fell on the ground and I earned a plus one reward. Now I have to do something 
to make him fall on the ground and that's how they start fighting and as you can see they are really close to each other as compared to before when they were just exploring the environment. Let's see how further they can go because at this video's timestamp of 7 minutes 5 seconds the final battle after 8 hours of training will start.